elevate, elevate. Only obligation is to tell it straight. So much on my plate, I gotta delegate. While I was watching this video, I literally was just thinking about how I'm here again today. Today is Wednesday the 28th. This video is like a week and a half old and I just got my life together again. It's like this constant cycle of falling on and off and on and off. So if you feel like that's you, you're not alone. This is the video for you because I'm going to share some of my tips for getting back on track and staying productive so that we can reach our goals obviously in the morning the first thing i like to do is make my bed and hop out of it okay and then i like to journal after i finish journaling i usually walk my brother to school and this is when me and sky also have our walk so after we do that i come back home and i've been trying to do something which is basically finish the things that are on the top of my to-do list that have been there for months so i have been meaning to organize my clothes and just throw out some stuff because the amount of clothes that i have that i haven't seen in months maybe even years is actually insane so i've been telling myself every day like i'm gonna get this together i'm gonna organize my gym stuff I'm going to give a lot of stuff away and I just kept not doing it. So that's what I decided to do today. I wanted to just get it over with. It wasn't a one day process. It was a two day process. And sometimes we just have to do what we have to do. I had to take a break. It was getting very, very overwhelming. This was just my swimwear, which is so crazy. I also was in the middle of washing. So I went ahead and put my clothes back. I basically just folded everything up and then like lined it up. I didn't even know that they have like containers for this. So I'm going to get those. And then I went ahead and started washing. One thing that I have learned is that this has nothing to do with, you know, staying productive though. But this is a very important part in building confidence. When you keep the small promises to yourself, you feel a lot better about yourself. So even if it's just, okay, you told yourself you're going to start washing, which for me, I cannot stand washing, you guys. I don't like folding. I don't like the process, but I have to do it every week or else my clothes will pile up. So when I put it off and I continue to put it off, it doesn't feel great at all. Of course, in the moment, it feels good because I'm not doing something that I don't want to do. But when I actually stick to it and I say, okay, today is Sunday. I'm going to finish washing in one day. I'm going to fold all my clothes in one day. It feels so good and it makes me feel confident. It's like nobody can tell me anything because I'm disciplined and I keep promises to myself. And then another thing is like, how can you expect people to show up for you if you don't even show up for yourself? Like you don't even do the little things for yourself. You don't get up when you say you're gonna get up. You wait another five minutes and then that turns into 10 minutes and then you're just endlessly and mindlessly scrolling on your phone without ever getting things done and I've been trying to keep myself like in check and kind of notice when I said okay I'm gonna get up in the next five minutes and then 10 minutes have gone by I really try to check myself to be like put the phone down and get up which is super hard because I be glued to my phone I'm not gonna lie but now let's go for a quick workout so this is today's gym fit. We got Abel on the fit, of course. This is one of my favorite colors, actually. Well, it used to be. Boom. So I do not know where my shaker is that I use for my pre-workout. So I am way behind. But pre-workout is Oxy Shred Mango. I do one scoop. This is linked on my Amazon if you want to go get it. it. Tastes really good. Bottle of water. Cheers. Yeah. 
this day I decided to do a full body workout. I've been trying to incorporate more full body and high intensity workouts into my split because I kind of feel like I've been at a halt with my progress. So each exercise, I did a circuit of each one. I believe I tried to reach 15 reps and I tried to repeat it for about four to five times, which honestly left my body really, really burning, but I love the feeling, who doesn't? Isn't it my birthday yet? Cause I gotta say, you're looking like a gift for me. Wrapped up nice and neat, baby. Get in my way now, don't be shy. We'll be here dancing day and night. Get in my groove now, don't be shy. Cause I got this list of my favorite things. You could be the part where it all begins. You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of it. Baby, I will show you how you can catch my vibe And right away I so much time Looping in the blurry lights So I had a really good workout today. I did a full body hit workout and then I did 25 minutes of cardio, 15 minutes on the Stairmaster and then 11 minutes on the treadmill. Y'all, I'm birth out. Cardio really like drains me Um, and my legs are on fire, like on fire. But now that I'm done with that, um, I'm gonna go to Target because I wanna get a new bed comforter. I want to get like a new blanket and then I also want to get, I want to get a new blanket. I want to get like some fall scented candles. Um, I want to get some hummus and I also want to get some, to see if I can find any like little fall finds, you know? Oh, I want to get some more pillows too because I only have three pillows and oh well if I get pillows then I gotta get sheets and then if I get sheets then I gotta get pillowcases. I'm so dry. I feel so tired. I have, I'm like my head is pounding it's time for me to eat lunch let's just see where oh, i'm so hungry okay let's just you could be the one i trust all the second chances say i'm nothing for us i like it all with the cherry on top be one of the things i love the things i love the things i love the things i love 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 the things i love the things i love So I got me a beef stick, beef stick for a snack because I was on the verge of becoming hangry, okay? I just got this. Now I'm gonna head home, got what I needed. I need to shower because I feel so sticky and just, ugh.
just showered. I have on a new outfit. It's pink. Let me show y'all in the mirror. Can we see? It's literally like different shades of pink. I don't know. I'm really like, it's like it matches, but it doesn't match, but it doesn't even matter because I feel good in it. But I have to go finish washing, which is super, super boring. I also have a test and it's a hundred points. So I really need to get that done. I might film some of it, but I really like to be like, you know, who my test. So we'll see. But after that, hummus and veggies i'm still hungry i'm not gonna lie and this is why i try to prioritize whoa so yeah after the hummus and the veggies i'm still hungry but i'm gonna drink some water first because it could just be that i'm thirsty um but this is why i like to prioritize my protein although hummus does have protein in it but a girl like me needs some meat so i'm gonna drink some water if I'm still hungry, then I'm going to make some tuna. And I'm going to have like some tuna over some sourdough toast because this is another thing about me. I love, oh sorry, how can I set y'all up? I don't have my thing. We're just going to hold it. I love carbs. Like I crave carbs. I love bread. It, like just anything. It's actually, I'm not going to say that it's necessarily like a bad thing, but it's really not the best because I could just eat cornbread like by itself. So when I say I love carbs, that's what I mean. Like, um, I love them. What am I looking for? Oh, so this is a drink that I picked up from, where did I get this from? Winko. It's a kombucha, the ginger lemon one, which is really, really good for your gut. It's 60 calories, 14 grams of carbs, and 11 grams of sugar. So I like to have half of this um, right now and then save the other half, let me show. I also forgot to give you guys a Target haul, so let me just show you what I got. I got a new glass. This is one of my favorite glasses because my mother broke mine, my other one. Then I got, ooh, ooh. I got some Tide Pods because I'm running out. Some more of these as a girl who works out and sweats her off. These help for my clothes. Like, I'm not even playing. It has my clothes smelling really good. Then I got this candle. This is the Autumn Harvest one. This smells like fall. It just smells so good. I'm about to light this right now. Then we got this candle, which is the Olive Leaf and Bergamot. I don't know if I said that right, but I love this. It reminds me of someone's house when I was younger who I used to go to. I just can't think of it, but it smells like a really, really, just like fresh, like a super fresh bathroom or wait, wait. Hold on. I love this. This has to go inside the bathroom because it just gives like bathroom. It just smells fresh, you know? But yeah, that's pretty much all that I got. I have to go to the garage to finish washing, so I'm just going to restock these. We can do a little restock together, you know? And then, let me wash this out. So, let's pour our drink. Oh, let me get some ice. Wash them ice. There you go. Whew, it's strong. It went right up my nose. Mm. Now that I'm drinking that, I think I'm just dehydrated. I'm not really hungry. So I have to. Everybody look at my stalker. Sky, you're a stalker. Where are you going, Sky? Come here. Sit. Lie down. Good girl. You want a treat? Come on. <laughs> lie down. Paw. Other paw. Good girl. Who dog y'all know that talented? Let me know. So I'm getting ready for a quiz. It's 100 points. Let's see how many. That's better. It almost rolled off the table. Let's see how many questions this quiz has because I don't have that long. I was vibing, I'm not gonna lie. I was not doing what I was supposed to be doing. I was just, answer saved automatically. What? Ooh, two hours and 30 minutes, but I have two attempts. What, two hours? 
Are they kidding me? Two fucking hours? How many questions? Come on, nah. Oh, wait. 30 questions? Okay. This this isn't bad. 30 questions is cool. Let's do this. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. <gasps> wait. If the answers are saved automatically, does that mean? Does that mean what I think it means? So as you can see, I finished my quiz and I'm really happy that I passed it. But I am seconds away from passing the oh that might be a little bit dramatic, but I definitely need some water. Like I don't I'm starting to feel sick. Ooh. It's almost time to pick my brother up, but I'm legit starting to like just need a nap. I don't even think I'm gonna walk today. I usually I need water. 